Hey everybody, it's Jen Matrano, um, coming to you from my car on a rainy day. Uh, I'm sitting here waiting for my kids to get off the school bus and I'm contemplating some things that had happened over the weekend and um, I feel like, I feel like, do you ever have those moments where you don't know whether to be happy or to be um, not sad or mad, just not happy. Um, but you know you should be happy. <laughs> one of those things. <laughs> I can't possibly be the only one who's felt this before. Like, I want to smile, and I want to be me, but sometimes, you know, it's hard to smile when you're going through stuff. Um, so I try to think on things that bring smiles to my face. Like, I love my family, I love my kids, um, I love my job, I love um, my friends, and I have a lot of joy in my life. But while I was thinking about those great and wonderful things to try to pull myself out of that funk of, you know, sadness or not happiness that I was telling you about, uh, God brought to the forefront of my brain my mind some things that I had never really thought about like momentum in your walk with God and I was like that's too deep to think about right now <laughs> my head's like ah, so much going on and I just didn't really feel like I wanted to dive into you know what does it mean Lord uh, momentum in your walk with me and it hit me um, he puts us on a path when we pray for uh, that path to be revealed and he we go with him and sometimes it's scary and for us the path that we chose was pretty scary me and my husband I mean without getting into too much detail I'm talking about a path God set us on 10 years ago yesterday Yesterday was 10 years that God had put me on, me and my husband on a path that was scary, but we did it. And, you know, somewhere along the line in those 10 years, my husband and I decided that um, we don't really, it's just, we're done. We're done that path. We're now moving on to a new season in life. And, you know, we, we just thought it was logical to... Um, go off of that path. I'm not talking about my path with the Lord. I'm not talking about my faith in Jesus Christ. I'm not talking about um, relying on the Holy Spirit. I'm not talking about my relationship with God at all. I'm talking about a life path, a choice that my husband and I made. Um, and we decided based on our circumstances that it was just time to move on um, out of that season and go about life and we stepped into new seasons and we stepped into new adventures and new opportunities and somehow we just assumed that God's um, momentum was just gonna stop because we decided it was time <laughs> and nothing bad happened we didn't think that it was the wrong decision at the time but now, given recent situations that we're dealing with, recent uh, current circumstances, God's re revealing to us that, you know, He never said it was over. He never said it was done. He never said, stop, um, get off this path. It's, this is your exit. You know, we never got that word from Him. And um, I had to ask for forgiveness today. From the Lord to say, God, I'm sorry. I didn't, I didn't, um, I didn't confirm with you that it was time to stop. And now, um, now I have to tell my husband <laughs> that, you know, that he was right, and the conversation we had is is true. And um, it's really great thing to have a husband that I have, that I, have, that I could communicate with him in this respect and be able to, uh, you know, pour my heart out and receive his 
outpouring and make decisions together because without him, I mean, nothing, no decision would be easy without the help of a man like my husband. So, um, I just want to ask everybody to keep praying for our family, um, as we, I guess, step back into, uh, God's plan that I guess wasn't over, um, in that season was not, hadn't changed yet. And, uh, we're trusting the Lord for this, um, continued season. So please pray for our family, pray for us and, um, stay tuned. I'm probably going to be, um, coming back on here with some news soon. So I love every one of you that message me and comment and call me and, uh, and support me and offer your prayer support to our family. It means more to me than I can ever express on a Facebook post. So, um, thank you from the bottom of my heart. And I look forward to, um, I look forward to giving you, um, guys some good news late uh, soon. Love you. Bye.